All right, it's been a little while since I've been able to record a job, but uh, now that I got a little bit more time, I can justify filming while working. So what I'm doing today is putting in a recycled asphalt milling path from this client's front yard, right around here, going all the way around to the backyard where they have a little farm set up. So he's just been driving on the uh, topsoil area here with his machines, and it's getting pretty sloppy when it's wet. So we're gonna cut all this up and bring the path all the way down to in front of the fence area there. And he was also looking to have it kind of funnel in, I believe on both sides, so that he has better uh, turning access to the path. So I think what I'm actually gonna try to do is take a lot of the material I'm stripping out of here and put it off this side right here, because there's a good dip right here, and it'll be worth kind of building up this side a bit more, especially on this, this hill. All right, well, I guess there was a conduit buried on the surface.
Yep, so this is a Comcast ran line. Just looking at the house up there, it has a Comcast tag on it. It's just a coax line. And uh, I don't know, this last 15, 20 feet is just on the surface. You can see when you pull this conduit, it's moving the grass right there. So I don't know, <laughs> I guess I'll have to call Comcast. All right, so to keep things moving, I'm just gonna start putting material in uh, and leave this spot open since I imagine they'll probably dig that up some more. I'll uh, just get myself a path to come in and out so I can get all the material spread down through the path uh, as it is now.
All right, everything is raked out. So I'll hit it with some water and then run the compactor over it all.
All right, I got this area as cleaned up as possible. Basically, the client had decided he would just dump it here on the grass because he didn't have anywhere else to put it. So he already kind of knew what was gonna happen after. So his plans were to get some more loam and have this area reseeded anyways. But I got out as much of the asphalt millings as possible and uh, it's pretty much ready for a little bit of a top coat and then some seed. All right, so the whole access path here is all graded out, packed down and uh, ready to be used. The only part that they have to wait on is unfortunately for Comcast to come and fix this pipe. Uh, but I left enough material here, they have a tractor and uh, they'll just push that pile right over after and uh, it'll be good to go. But got this hole filled in over here, lifted the side a bit, leveled out this path a bit more so it's better to go down. All right, so I'm actually back on this job where I put in the asphalt millings. Um, they got the pipe fixed over this last week for their Comcast, so I'll fix that asphalt millings there. And they also wanted to put millings under this carport they just put up. So I have about six tons of millings here, plus the tractor, so I can get in and out of this carport without damaging it, hopefully. Um, and I'll basically be stripping everything out up through the driveway uh, all the way out and around to make a connection in. So over on this side he said there's a cable that goes to this back corner of the house that they don't know what it does or goes to I believe that I think goes through here. Um, he said not to worry about that one and then he just hand dug this electrical uh, U right here so I will hand dig this area out.
Alright, got this carport all finished up, got a good layer of asphalt millings in there, and uh, got it all compacted and set up for him, he's very happy with it. So he can use this carport now for a side-by-side -side or truck, and uh, keep it out of the elements, and keep it from getting all muddy. And we finished patching up the spot over here where the line was taken out, so this all looks good now. and. Uh, They've been using it and liking it. So I'll probably be back for a couple more projects. I know he was talking to me about possibly putting in a retaining wall here, um, finishing the sides of his driveway, which is like 600 feet long with some material uh, and possibly a million other things. So I imagine I'll be back here doing something else.